<laughs> Indeed, we have indeed, guys. Thank you very much. Joanne, it's interesting they said Elvis Presley because... Yeah, because mine would be Elvis Presley as uh, yeah. well. I Elvis know. the Young Years. Elvis the Young, Elvis yes. the Jailhouse Rock Boy. Ah, of mm. course. Mm. He was... Oh, look! No, no, that's older. That's older. I think, no, you're thinking of when he was when, when he, he was first a babe. started. Yeah, with when the he first started. Of the hair. He was and he had, lovely. Yeah. And, he, and all the shaking and all, and all that going yeah. on. Now, look, you're doing a great thing because right now it's nearly spring. You wouldn't think it with the weather, but yeah. it is nearly spring. And I'm doing a big clear out. So I'm perfect for this um, big campaign that you're doing. Which is called Schwapping. Schwapping. Which is called every time you go into MS, take something you never wear with you and just drop it in the Schwap Drop box. It's a good idea, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's fantastic. Really because good the idea. terrible truth is, is that we throw away something like a billion garments a year. Crazy. Which means that every five minutes we throw away ten... We throw away 10,000 garments, which goes straight to landfill. So what M&S do is they give it to Oxfam. Oxfam either resell it on, in their high street shops in, right. in Britain or they sell them in Eastern Europe or in Africa. Right. And if they can't do anything with them, they remake it into fibre and reuse it. So oh, nothing brilliant. goes to landfill. It's a brilliant idea, actually, Lorraine, because we've... Look, let's be honest. We've got... <laughs> We've got things, haven't we? We've got things. Many, many things. We've, We've got, got far things too much that we know we're not going to wear it. again. And I know. I hang on to stuff, do you know? And I think I've got things back from the TVAM days in the yes. 80s. Pretty horrendous. But I think one day, this bright yellow object... Well, this is yellow, so that's OK. But this bright yellow and pink and green, because yes. it was all like that, yes. will come back into fashion and it's not... Do you know, it doesn't. And we it's wait and wait and we think. But then we don't want to throw <laughs> it away because we've spent money on it and it's actually all right. But you're ashamed to take it to the charity shop in case they see it's used, <laughs> given it... <laughs> So the truth is, <laughs> take it and shop it. Absolutely. Because it's Nobody got another life. It's got another life. <laughs> and just to be serious for a second, we do owe it to the planet not to keep throwing things away. Indeed. Abs you know, absolutely. And it if does somebody else so can... much good for developing countries. Yes, this, it's if really somebody can get a, a weird outfit, then that's <clears> absolutely. It's brilliant. Absolutely fabulous, as you would uh, yeah. say. Is there going to be a movie of Abfab? Well, Jennifer, what do you think? I mean, what is she like? She <laughs> announced it, so now, we, now she's going to do it. Right. Because she can only make herself work nowadays by announcing it on television. So <laughs> she announces it. Yes. And then she has, and to, I do has it. to do it. But we have been talking about it for 20 years. I know, you know that's the notion true. of a movie. And it's kind of, we kind of, yes, no, yes, no. But this time I think we really will do it and it'll be fantastic. Excellent. Because yeah. I do remember very memorably when Patsy came on your. Your Patsy came on breakfast television and she was so nervous she threw up over the back of the sofa. Do you remember? And she just sat there going, She, yeah, she completely yeah, yeah. dried and she couldn't, she forgot the word accessories. <laughs> so she had to just say bags, gloves, scarves. <laughs> She thought afterwards, <laughs> in the, one of those sort of false memories, she thought she was wonderful. <laughs> no, she went home and said, I was great. Oh, what know, a fantastic. great character, though. She has been fantastic <laughs> for you to play, hasn't I've she? I've loved her. Yeah, Absolutely. She's been terrific. You know, just great fun. Great fun. Um, and you do, you do some... I know you do an awful lot of campaigning work. You've always been like that. And I know you do brilliant work with the Gurkhas, which is fantastic, but very private to you, which I think is very, very good. Um, but you are somebody who, when you attach your name to something, people will set up and... and because you're very honest and you, people perceive you very trusting. Worthy, well, I, I love you for saying that, Lorraine, because the truth is I don't do anything I don't really believe in. Yeah. And that goes for advertising things or doing things. Absolutely. There's yeah. no point in being a hard gun. It doesn't work. People can see through it. Totally. The place, public are smart. They know mm. things. They know when you're telling the truth or not. And if you're behind something and you believe in it, and you can stand up and actually assure people at home that you say, you don't have time to check these things out, but I've done it for you. Yeah. I promise you this is OK. Mm. Then I think people go, oh, that's great. I feel like that myself, and I'm sure we're quite often asked to do things. And you look at it and you go, mm, mm, mm. oh, look, censors on it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the reason I got involved with shopping was that Jonathan Porritt was there, and I thought, well, if Porritt is there... Yeah, yeah. I mean, I think the world of, of MS anyway, but if Jonathan Porritt is there with his yeah. background and his extraordinary track record, mm. I thought, we're flying. Well, you know, we're flying. It sort of makes sense, doesn't yeah. it? It makes complete sense. Now, look, we have got yeah. um, Coronation Street's Bill Roach on next week. <gasps> And, of course, you go back a long way, don't Be you? Be still my beating heart. <laughs> now, look, quite honestly, the truth is, my name was Elaine Perkins, and Ken Barlow fell in love with her, and she was the schoolmaster's daughter, and he said, marry me, Elaine. And guess what? She said no. <laughs> and I'd been hoping to get into the show, and I only had eight episodes. Oh, but everybody's still going to be on. He's going to be on. He's going to be on next week. Can you believe he's 80? No. No, it's... Uh, no. He's lying. I think he's lying. Mm. <laughs> It's a sympathy thing he's trying to say. <laughs> Do you think so? Yeah, he's only 62. I think he's... Well, he doesn't even... He looks incredible. He's extraordinary, he? isn't he? Yeah. I know, but it, it was interesting that he said he slept with a thousand women. And you can sort of <gasps> understand <gasps> it. Did he say... Did he say that? I was out of the country. Did you say that? <laughs> yes, he did. Bill, did you say that? This seems a very strange <laughs> Absolutely. thing Absolutely. You were an on-screen conquest only. We should, <laughs> we should make that very, 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 very clear. And talking about him looking great, you do as well. Thank you, you look very much indeed. And you, you don't have to work too hard at it, though, I think, is it? No, you've got amazing cheekbones. Oh, darling, heavier makeup and bright colours, that's what I say. 
Good. Yeah. yeah exactly. See? And look at us. Look at us. Well, a bright, bright, bright. Yes. Yeah. So that's that's the secret, is and it? And keep smiling. And quite honestly, nobody looks too close. And also, the other thing is with photographs nowadays, you can Photoshop them. Of course. Somebody you can. said to me, "Is that really what you look like nowadays?" And I said, "Ty, it's been it's been all everything's been combed out. Come and look closer." And of course, these cameras can see you. These are the devils. These high definition ones. They go. <laughs> I know they are horrible. They're horrible things. Yeah. It's like when they say, "We'll, we'll do a close up, not too not close." Too you know, like Tootsie. <laughs> I bring my own gauzes just in case I can put it over my head like that. <laughs> That's an idea. That is a brilliant idea. Joanne, it's always a joy to see you. Good Lovely luck with girl. the shopping. I'm going to do that myself, actually, when yeah. I get back, because I have got so much stuff that I don't need, and I'll get it in there. You're Thank a star. You. Thank you so much. Right, now then, what shall we do? We'll do the competition. Your chance.